Oh no, another hard challenge. Oh wow, seriously, Ross? Now this was like all the last dungeon was. How is this considered difficult? Also, really loud sound effect. For the win. God damn, that's loud. Pump. Good to go. And down we fall. And get ourselves a free chest. This is a badge, right? That's a shrink stomp. That's not even that good. Wait, don't I already have shrink stomp or do I have soft stomp? I don't remember. Sleepy stomp, I have soft stomp, and yeah, I do have shrink stomp. Mm-hmm. Okay, then. Well, down we go. Where's Contoisio at? There you are, my man. Get over here, man. I'll put you onto the block, I suppose. To the block, prisoner! That was a pretty good jump. Coops didn't make it, but I did. I have four shine sprites on me. That's a pretty good amount right there. Up, oh, wrong one. I'll get this eventually, guys. I'm pretty smart at this game. It's just I'm stupid at this game, so you know. Shit like that happens all the time. Alright, Consuazio. You need to sit your butt right down here. Oh wait, we need this we need the orb. God damn it. Well it looks like you're traveling with us, Consuazio. You know what? He's just literally gonna complicate everything. He literally is. There's no way I can really see around it. Unless I forcefully somehow lost this guy, which I don't know how I'd do that. Like something like that. Just force myself to lose him, but even then that's like impossible to do. We have an idea. Here's what we'll do. We'll go right here, and then I'll fall down. He can't follow me. And then I can like Huh, damn it. Man, this is like trying to lose your kid in the supermarket when you just want to have some time alone to yourself. It doesn't really work that well. Oy. I honestly keep saying all these references, but I don't even have any kids, so I don't, even, I don't even know what I'm saying. Don't trust me with kids, kids. Remember that. Okay. Maybe Consuazio won't make this impossible. Who knows? Oh, wait, yeah, here we... Wait, no, this will make it impossible. Son of a bitch, Consuazio. Why do you gotta make everything hard? Actually, wait, no, it won't. No, it won't. No, it won't. Alright, I think we're still good. Alright, time to fix everything. Alrighty. Ugh. Gotcha. So we got some of the punies, but how do we get the rest of them? Well, for that, we're gonna have to put this orb in here, and we're gonna have to blow them. As usual. If you don't know what to do, blow it. That's usually how it works. By the way, this part kind of sucks, because blowing them all into the hole is really obnoxious. Alright, get over here. Reset. And do it again. God damn this part. It just doesn't work. That's all I gotta say about it. Doesn't work. I don't like it. Son of a bitch! Alright, now fall in the freaking hole. There you go. Now we can go down, get a hundred punies, and get a hundred punies. Yeah, we, we just need to go get our friend over there, Consuazio. Yeah, Consuazio actually won't ruin the system, surprisingly. Get over here, you idiot. We'll be there for you in uh, two shakes of a lamb's tail. Oh, god damn it! Why? This one's easier, but still obnoxious. They have to force us to do this shit. You sort of just have to do it lightly. I don't know, that's the only thing I can recommend. Alright, you guys, get over there. Come on. Don't ruin everything. And we're golden! Time to finish off this goddamn dungeon. All 101 in hand, somehow. Thank God. I remember what happened to Jobble. He, he just doesn't exist. Whatever. It's whatevs. By the way, doing this whole section, getting here first, was totally unnecessary. We could have just grabbed these guys first and then done it. But I like to do this part first just so they don't get scared by nothing. Yeah. Reasons. What are those? This is the I don't give a shit let's play after all. Alright, well, it's time to go have ourselves an escape sequence, fight an obnoxiously easy boss, and then, you know, 
Eh, the rest. Alright, with all 101 in hand. What? I forgot the orb. I forgot the fucking orb. Are you kidding me? How did I forget the orb? That's impossible. That's impossible! Alright, well, I forgot the orb. Good shit. And like any good Let's Player won't cut this out, I won't. Yeah, you know. This is the I Don't Give a Shit Let's Play after all, so you get to see all my failure and all my stupidity. Oh, joy. Isn't it great just to watch me walk back and go recollect an orb? Hey, Ross, tell a story in the meanwhile while you're doing this. Once upon a time, there was an ugly barnacle who decided he wanted to go file his taxes. Only problem is he forgot his puny orb at home, so he wasn't able to actually file his taxes in completion. And everyone died. The end. Okay, punies. Guys, stop it. Don't, don't be stupid right now. That's my job. What the fuck? Okay, seriously? Seriously, guys. Don't go full stupid on me right now. We're so close. Alright, are we good? We good. We in there. We in there, literally. Alright, where's the fracking orb? It's over here, right? That's the only thing that makes sense. Oh, I'm stupid. I could have sworn I grabbed the damn orb. Down we go. Thank God the AI on this isn't absolutely terrible. It's always somewhat terrible. Because I think if it was any worse than this, this level would literally be Hell Incarnate. But as it stands, it's only mildly obnoxious. Ugh. Technically, you don't even need to run away the punies from this escape section as well, I think. But I'm going to do it anyway, just in case, and also because it's fun. Not really. I just I just want to do it just in case it fucks me if I don't. Also, it'd be kind of mean just to leave them all there. Even though you could just have the guy call them with the punies. Though he's kind of busy dealing with Lord Crump at the moment, if I'm not mistaken. Or at least after a couple seconds, he'll be busy dealing with Crump. Alright. Game. Set match. Oh yeah! GG! Okay, so how much stuff we got? Yeah, we definitely need to heal up. That shroom shroom, or that shroom whatever the fuck I used was completely unnecessary to use in the long run, but whatever. Worked out anyhow. Save our game. And it's time to get moving. Yeah, I want to have all the peonies with me for the time being. Let's go. Ah, here we go. Puh! He really doesn't understand how to count, does he? Somewheres. This guy really just doesn't get it. Alright, well, time to shake some stuff. Where we're shake it, as usual. Just seeing if we can't find any free items, but I doubt it. Um, I'm guessing that's a no. Yeah, we're good to go. Later, losers. I wonder if you could, like, find him behind the pillar. Be like, yo, don't, don't blow my cover, man. That'd be hilarious. I think you could get this without actually, like, you know, hitting the orb. Maybe. If you're lucky. Maybe not. Nope, just make it easy for yourself, Ross. And we're done. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, no! <laughs> Can anyone else not think of, like, a very certain porno Atari game whenever they hear that sound, though? Thank you, Angry Video Game Nerd. Beat him and eat him. Oh, God. What have I got myself into? And he's going to use the titanic self-destruct button. Good lord. 
Well, time to roll. Away we go. Okay, actually going the pipe, damn it. This is honestly not a hard timer in the slightest. Of course he's running away. Huh. Of course it counts in battle, so that's a little obnoxious. Don't take forever due to your decisions, guys. Just wreck them. You should be able to wreck them all in one hit. Especially if you leveled up Goombella. Not Koops or even Flurry. Just, just Goombella. That's why I think she's the best party member. For right now that you can have. Anything in here? Anything cool? Yeah, I'll waste my time to look at all this shit because I got time. I got time for days. There was nothing. Oh, there was Starpies. Look at that shit. Look what I would have missed. See? This is why you like checking shit. I have eight star pieces right now. I'm on my way to getting that uh power up, whatever the hell it's called. Whatever badge that is. Ridiculously expensive, but super useful. Would be nice to have that before the glitz pit, but that means I have to get seven star pieces, which I think I can do. Shouldn't be that difficult. Alright, we need to go either up or to the left. I think we need to go up. Yeah, we need to go up. Yeah, this is honestly not a hard timer to make in the slightest. I really don't understand why I'm carrying the peonies at this point in time, but you know, eh, emotion's sake, and you know, Consuazio might be in there somewhere. In fact, he, he is, so. Consuazio. Yeah, someone totally should make a Consuazio fan art if, if you have no time on your life. Especially if you have no time in your hands. You need to make Consuazio a picture. Just for me. Just to make me happy. If you do, like, I'll love you forever. For like five minutes. I don't know. Somewhere around that time. Hell, I'll probably just make my own Consuazio picture. Alright, guys. You really can't be doing this right now. You're sort on a time limit that's not strict in the slightest, so, you know. Alright, we're good to go. Alright, let's go, losers. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. And let's rock. Oh, wait, no, no, I want Flurry, though. No, 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 get the hell out of my party. Good to go. I love this part. Just the fact that it continues counting the counter. Like, this game knew what it was doing with its humor. Uh, it's, it's funny. Elder power activates. There's another part where I should realize it's a grandma. That sounded violent. That's like a sound effect from Family Guy right there. Now lines like that, like hot-headed Okut, that, that just seems more aimed towards grandpas. I don't know. It's just lines like that. Alright. Hmm. 9641. You can totally do that much faster than I did. Alright, time to rock! Oh, this is going to be challenging. Oh no, an Agnes Fong Grapple. Honestly, the first boss is harder than this guy, especially how the like I fought the first boss. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for Magnus Von Grapple. Tuh. It should be on with Tishy, so you know. Just like cars is. Yeah. Here we go. We're going to absolutely destroy this guy. I'm not even joking right now when I say that. First off, burn the shit out of him. Then we're going to tattle him just for curiosity's sake to know what he has on him. That's Magnus Von Grapple. 30 HP, some defense, not much attack at all. This guy kind of sucks. Oh, here it comes. Oh, no. Two damage. Seriously. Like, what? We did six damage to you in one turn. One turn, guys. 
There's another five. Sure, let's stack on multi bonk. What the hell? All right, well, he's already down to 13. <laughs> like, this is how sad this guy is. Just not challenging in the slightest. He does have some fists. How should we deal with that, I wonder? Oh, wait, I have an idea. Here's what we'll do. We'll call it, uh, we'll do Fire Drive. Then we'll switch to uh, Goombella. And instead of doing anything special, we're just going to, like, Thunderbolt everything. Oh, wait, that only hits one enemy? Oh, oh well. I thought they hit multiple. I guess that's only Thunder Rage does. Ow, that kind of hurt. Ow. This is kind of pathetic. All right, you know what? Just, just go fuck him up, Mario. Fuck him up something royal. Uh. Yeah, multi bounce sounds pretty good. All right, and time to be destroyed. Well, just about. He's not dead yet. He's probably gonna have to like shake the ground a little bit more. I will say this, he's pretty difficult to guard. Man, I did a lot shooter on this boss than I usually do. Oh well. Probably because I fucked up on that Thunder Rage. We win. And we don't have to go through the bullshit that is those damn poison mushrooms. Almost another level up. Right before we leave the cave. Good to go. GG, everybody. If you can't render it, don't make it. That's the lesson for the day, children. And also, Cons Consuazio is pretty sweet. That's the other message of the day. Can I fight you guys just so I can level up real fast? Yo, go beat the shit out of Mario. No. Alright. Ah, well, I just threw my controller behind my back and literally all the batteries popped out. That was, that was the most glorious thing I think I could have ever done. Oh, son of a bitch. It dropped into, like, a sleeping bag. Now I have to go find the battery. Are you fucking kidding me? I don't give a shit. Let's play, children. Welcome to it. Oh, wait, there's a battery right here. Let's just use that. Oh, well. <laughs> there's a battery right here. I'll find that battery later. Man, there's one thing I gotta say about these controllers, though. Like, this right here. This wave bird. What the hell happened with, like other controllers nowadays. Like, not the PlayStation controller, because that one's rechargeable, but, like, the Xbox controller, why does that shit die after maybe 10 hours of use? This one can last for up to God knows how many days. This is like having a light bulb for a controller. Because light bulbs last forever. Usually. I don't know. Sometimes they break. And with that, the game is done. Except we have to do more Peach segments, but we'll probably do this next time. So when we come back next time for more Paper Mario Thousand Year Door, we're going to do the next Peach segment, and also the Bowser segment after that. And the Bowser segment is going to be super fun, although I'm probably going to fuck up on it. See you guys for that next time. Later, losers. Why the hell did I say that? I don't know. Crump is rubbing off on me. Crump-a-bomb. Bullshit.